which class of antibodies is the most abundant in the blood stream of human immune system your options are iga igd igg or ige and the correct answer is c that is igg igg antibodies are the most abundant class of antibodies in the blood stream providing long term immunity against a wide range of pathogens and toxins question number 22 which cells are involved in the clearance of immune complexes and dead cells in the human immune system your options are macrophages neutrophils dendritic cells or mast cells the correct answer is a that is macrophages macrophages play a central role in phagocytosis and the clearance of immune complexes apoptotic cell and cellular debris contributing to tissue hemostasis and resolution of inflammation question number 23 which cells are involved in the regulation and suppression of immune responses in the human immune system your options are b cells t cells regulatory t cells or mast cells and the correct answer is c that is regulatory t cells regulatory t cells play a crucial role in maintaining immune tolerance and preventing autoimmune reactions by suppressing the activation and proliferation of other immune cells question number 24 so friends you are attending 100 mcqs based on human immunity system immunology and this is part 2 of this series and i'm sure that you don't want to miss the first part as first part contains more special questions so friends the link has been given in the descriptions so please go and watch it completely to get fit for upcoming exams and at the end if you find this video helpful then please do support us by liking and subscribing and sharing this video to all those friends who are preparing for exams so not taking more time let's continue question number 24 which cells are responsible for antigen presentation to both naive t cells and b cells in the human immune system your options are macrophages dendritic cells natural killer cells or eosinophils the correct answer is b that is dendritic cells Dendritic cells are professional antigen presenting cells capable of activating both naive T cells and B cells initiating adaptive immune responses against pathogens. Question number 25 Which cytokine is primarily involved in promoting the differentiation of B cells into plasma cells in the human immune system? The options are interleukin 2 IL2 interleukin 4 il4 interleukin 10 il10 or interleukin 21 il21 the correct answer is d that is interleukin 21 il21 il21 plays a key role in promoting the differentiation of b cells into plasma cells enhancing antibody production and the humoral immune response question number 26 Which cells are primarily responsible for initiating the inflammatory response upon tissue injury in the human immune system? Your options are mast cells, neutrophils, macrophages, or eosinophils. The correct answer is A. That is mast cells. Mast cells are among the first cell to respond to tissue injury or infection. releasing histamine and other inflammatory mediators that trigger vasodilation and increased vascular permeability and recruitment of other immune cells question number 27 which cells are primarily responsible for the 
formation of germinal centers in secondary lymphoid organs in the human immune system the options are b cells t cells dendritic cells or macrophages the correct answer is a that is b cells b cells play a central role in the formation of germinal centers within secondary lymphoid organs where they undergo clonal expansion somatic hypermutation and class switching to produce high affinity antibodies question number 28 which cytokine is primarily involved in promoting the differentiation of naive t cells into th2 cells in the human immune system the options are interleukin 2 il2 interleukin 4 il4 interleukin 12 il12 or interferon gamma the correct answer is b that is interleukin 4 il4 il4 promotes the differentiation of naive t cells into th2 cells which play a crucial role in promoting humoral immunity and activation of b cells question number 29 which class of antibodies is primarily found in mucosal secretions such as saliva tears and breast milk in the human immune system iga igd ige or igg the correct answer is a that is iga iga antibodies are predominantly found in mucosal secretions where they provide localized immunity against pathogens by neutralizing and preventing their entry into the body question number 30 which cells are involved in the destruction of virus infected cells and tumor cells through perforin mediated cytolysis in the human immune system the options are b cells t cells natural killer cells or eosinophils the correct answer is c that is natural killer cells natural killer cells can induce apoptosis in virus infected cell and tumor cells through the release of perforin and granzyme contributing to the elimination of infected or abnormal cells question number 31 which type of hypersensitivity reaction involves the formation of immune complexes the deposit in tissues and trigger inflammation in the human immune system the options are type 1 hypersensitivity type 2 hypersensitivity type 3 hypersensitivity or type 4 hypersensitivity and the correct answer is c that is type 3 hypersensitivity The type 3 hypersensitivity reactions occur when immune complexes formed by antigens and antibodies deposits in tissues leading to complement activation and inflammation contributing to disease like lupus and rheumatoid arthritis. Question number 32 Which cells are responsible for the production of antibodies with high affinity and and specificity in the human immune system the options are plasma cells memory b cells t helper cells or dendritic cells the correct answer is a that is plasma cells plasma cells are terminal differentiated by cells specialized in the antibody production generating antibodies with high affinity and specificity against specific antigens encountered during an immune responses question number 33 which cytokine is primarily involved in the differentiation of naive t cells into regulatory t cells tricks in the human immune system the options are interleukin 2 il2 interleukin 4 il4 transforming growth factor beta tgf or interleukin 10 il10 and the correct answer is c that is transforming growth factor beta 
the transforming growth factor beta plays a crucial role in the differentiation of naive T cells into regulatory T cells, which are essential for maintaining immune tolerance and suppressing excessive immune responses. Question number 34. Which cells are involved in the formation of granulomas in response to persistent antigenic stimulation in the human immune system? Your options are B cells, T cells, macrophages or eosinophils. The correct answer is C that is macrophages. Macrophages play a central role in the formation of granulomas organized collection of immune cells in response to persistent antigenic stimulation as seen in diseases like tuberculosis and sarcoidosis. Question number 34. Question number 35. Which class of antibodies is the first to be produced in response to primary immune response in the human immune system? Your options are IgA, IgD, IgM or IgG. The correct answer is C, that is IgM. IgM antibodies are the first class of antibodies produced during a primary immune response, appearing before other antibody classes and serving as the initial defense against pathogens. Question number 36. Which cells are primarily responsible for the secretion of cytokines that regulate immune responses in the human immune system. Your options are B cells, T cells, natural killer cells or macrophages. And the correct answer is B that is T cells. T cells including both CD plus 4 helper T cells and CD8 plus cytotoxic T cells are major producers of cytokines that regulate various aspects of immune responses such as inflammation, activation and differentiation of other immune cells. Question number 37. Which cytokine is primarily involved in promoting the differentiation of naive B cells into plasma cells in the human immune system? Your options are interleukin 2 IL-2 interleukin 4 IL-4, interleukin 10 IL-10 or interleukin 21 IL-21. The correct answer is B that is interleukin 4 IL-4. IL-4 plays a key role in promoting the differentiation of naive B cells into plasma cells, enhancing antibody production and the humoral immune response. Question number 38. Which cells are primarily responsible for the production of antibodies during the secondary immune response in the human immune system? Your options are plasma cells, memory B cells, T helper cells or dendritic cells. The correct answer is A that is plasma cells. Plasma cells derived from activated B cells are responsible for the production of antibodies during the secondary immune response, leading to a faster and more robust antibody production compared to the primary responses. Question number 39. Which class of antibodies is involved in the activation of the complement system in the human immune system? Your options are IgA, IgD, IgM or IgG. And the correct answer is C that is IgM. IgM antibodies are efficient, are efficient activators of the complement system leading to the formation of membranes attack complex MSC and the lysis of target cells coated with IgM antibodies. Question number 40. Which cells are primarily responsible for the release of inflammatory mediators such as, such as histamine in the human immune system? Your options are B cells, T cells, mast cells or eosinophils. The correct answer is C that is mast cells. Mast cells are specialized immune cells that release inflammatory mediators including histamine in response to allergens or pathogens contributing to allergic reactions and inflammation. 
happy friends it is a time to comment your score and friends thanks for joining us on this exciting journey if you enjoyed the quiz and learned something new then give us a thumbs up and let us know in the comment section and don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you never miss out on our upcoming exploration of fascinating topics in the medical field until the next time stay curious stay healthy see you take care